Yo guys and welcome back to the channel. Sit back, relax and enjoy as we play some more Persona 5 Royal. Hope you guys enjoy this gameplay and as always, without a doubt, I'll see you on the next one. The case is finally closed. There are no shackles on you anymore. We changed the heart of someone huge, like the next Prime Minister. There's no better finale than that. This may be the opportune time to end our deal. I'm sure you'll be fine now. You can manage without me being with you. <sighs> Don't worry, I won't leave immediately. But if I just stay here, I won't recall anything. I'm a bit envious of you. Here I am. Still haven't found anything about myself. If only I could find out what's in the depths of mementos. Let's go to sleep. You must be tired. I can't believe even Shido-san had a change of heart triggered in him. We got where we are today because we had him take care of whoever got in our way. If a case is assembled against him, everything about us will be exposed too. What are we supposed to do? That's precisely why we've gathered to discuss our options. Prosecutor Nijima is serious about taking Shido-san to court, right? Isn't she under your command? You have to do something! Yes, I'm aware. But even if we prevent her from doing so, what about the public? Shido-san's conduct was shameful. We'll just have to continue his policies for a rich country. A rich country? You mean that plan of advancing foreign affairs by controlling people's hearts? After all, the research on it should be proceeding along. We'll push that plan forward and continue eliminating any who get in our way by using that world. We'll pledge to build a powerful country. We ourselves will meet the expectations we had of Shido-san. A powerful country, huh? I see. But even if we do pick up where he left off, would his other associates keep quiet about it? We should be fine in that regard. Anyone who Shido-san aided would feel that their life is at stake after watching that conference, just as we are now. At any rate, it seems we must first stop that case from being assembled, no matter the cost. How do we control public opinion? Thankfully, support for Shido-san still exists. Masayoshi Shido was a hero who fell before achieving his goals, and we will carry his torch. That's what we'll announce to the mass media. I see. Considering the public's panic after losing their leader, they may latch onto that immediately. But if the general public becomes our enemy, we're done for. That means there's no turning back. Well then, leave Nijima to my group. Can we rely on yours in regards to Shido-san? We'll make it so that he requires a psychiatric evaluation. Everyone, we're in the same boat. You had best not forget that.
I don't get it. Sorry that I failed to mention your exams. I was busy dealing with some of Shido's cronies. Well, you are students, so it's only fitting you're doing a study group. You're gonna bring us some snacks now and then, right? <laughs> you don't even have exams. Pardon the intrusion. Oh, glad to see you all. You're too kind. We'll take you up on that offer. Why did you bring me here? My school's exams are already over. Come on, don't be so cold. You saying it's fine if I fail? Nothing wrong with that. Won't the results be the same whether you study or not? Now, now, you guys. Just think of it as helping me out. I don't know about this. I'm just going to focus on sections that may likely be on the test. You're way too short on time. Making a gamble, huh? If she's wrong, we die. Uh, I don't want to die. Um, is it really that bad? This is every day for them. This affects you, too. Well, with your grades, I'm not too worried. But you've missed a lot of classes, so it couldn't hurt to study. Oh, yeah. He's good at studying. Oh, I feel kind of betrayed. And betrayed might be a bit much. Don't worry, Lady On. Even if you're not great at studying, I'll... Now then, let's get to it. What do you want me to teach you? I don't remember much about social stuff. Me neither. I do remember one thing, though. Something about a sunrise and Mount Fuji. Sunrise and Mount... Oh, yeah. The earliest place where you can watch the sun rise in Japan is at the peak of Mount Fuji. The teacher said that although latitude and longitude are important, the critical factor is altitude. You remembered all that from what Ryuji said? That's unreal. How about taking a break? Oh, sounds good to me. I can't do anymore. So, like, we've been doing Phantom Thief work all this time, right? We learned a bunch doing that. Even if we study and learn what we can in school, uh, doesn't it feel kind of pointless? At the very least, it's necessary for Ryuji. You want to say that again? Those sorts of experiences are important, too. But common sense is just as important. You should know better than anyone how nasty adults without common sense can be. That's a great point. Someday you'll graduate high school and become adults. Then, when you get married, you'll need common sense more than ever. Marriage, huh? Do you want to get married? I see. Well, that won't be for a while. In the meantime, I'm more concerned with what I'm going to be eating tomorrow. Oh, cut it out, man. You're making me hungry. Well, I guess we just got to get back to studying. That concludes the last subject. 
Ah, uh, that took... We covered all the difficult parts, so you should probably be fine. Good work, everyone. See? You can do it if you try. Ugh, we're finally done. Ryuji's hopeless. What did you say? Well, whatever happens, happens. Isn't it about time you wrapped it up? Be careful on your way home. Sucks that you have to do exams even after changing Shido's heart and saving the country. It's rough being a human. But looking at you, I feel kind of jealous of humans. Hey. What would you like? Take your time. Choosing? Sure thing. Hmm, that one. Even though it gets dry in the winter, be careful. Guns are prone to miss. That's what you're choosing? The air's dry, so be careful when you're handling gunpowder. Hmm, that one. All right. All right, which one? Okay, sounds good. Seeing as how you're in my shop, huh? You change your mind or something? Okay, so come again.
That's right. should be grateful. exams mm. we're the heroes who saved this country right can't we be exempt from exams and is it just me or do we not have as big a sense of accomplishment as i thought that's it people are so doubtful even after the press conference he hasn't been arrested so i guess that's expected we just gotta leave it to makoto's sister now Morning to you. It's been quite a while since we last met at school like this. Thank you for your efforts in changing Representative Shido's. Well, if anything, you're the one deserving all of the thanks, Senpai. We should go somewhere to celebrate. Ah, oh, what say we go pay our first respects to the shrine? A new year is about to begin and all. suppose we ought to deal with exams first. I'll be in touch afterwards. Please excuse me. All right, let's begin. That doesn't look like it'll work.
Now everyone. That doesn't look like it'll work. the last day of exams. Are things going well for you? I'm doing the same as usual. Well, no problems. I'm all right with it, but my sister hasn't come home these past few days. I think she has a lot on her plate with building a case against Shido. He has connections to powerful people. I'm sure they want him cleared to save their own skins. Yeah, still, Shido confessed already. That is an indisputable fact. And it's my sister. She'll see it through, I'm sure. With that said, now isn't the time for us to slack off either. Do you remember what the exams will cover? I'll check on the train for you. Let's get started.
Hey. Yeah. Oh, honey. Hey, hey. 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 
Thanks. Hey! They announced the poor health of their leader, Masayoshi Shido. 
As such, the special diet session was postponed, along with Shido's inauguration as Prime Minister. Postponed? They should be firing him! And wait, poor health? This is completely different from what my sister told us. I heard he barely slept during the election campaign. I don't blame him. He's not going to step down now, is he? Will this country be fine without Shido? How can people still believe in him? What the heck? The Phantom Thieves are being treated like, well, like they never existed. Goodness. No link among the change of heart incidents. Only coincidental psychiatric disorders. The Phantom Thieves only use those rumors to their advantage. This is preposterous. Who would believe such things? But the person saying this is a famous researcher. And even the Ministry is saying that's how they determined the situation too. When's Shido gonna make a comeback? Honestly, I don't think anyone else but Shido can handle times like these. What's going on? No matter how you look at it, this isn't normal. Yeah, it's as if the people in reality have become distorted. What's happening here worries me, but the only thing we can do right now is wait and see what happens. What do you mean I can't question him at this point? Mr. Shido is in an extremely unstable state. I can't allow you to get in contact with him. He may officially have to undergo a psychiatric evaluation at this rate. We are at the cusp of making a case. Do you know how much trouble we've gone through to get this far? I'm just doing my job as a doctor. Even if Shido was behind it, do you plan on convicting a central figure behind such a historical change? What? Don't be ridiculous. This is a country governed by law. You still want to protect him even though you know what happened to the man previously at your post. So, you plan on taking the head of the nation to court. You need to take a break, Nijima. I'm taking you off this case, especially since it's rumored you have ties to the Phantom Thieves. What? If I recall correctly, you still aren't married, are you? You'll be on leave for a long time. Why not look for a husband while you're at it? The assembly of Shido's case is in danger? We know he doesn't need a psychiatric evaluation! His lackeys must have pressured the others around him. It means there's far more people who'd be in trouble if the truth came out than we imagined. Isn't there anything we can do? Sis said the assembly of a case may be possible if the general public wants Shido held accountable. But even that chance has been destroyed with the manipulation of the mass media. They made it clear that the argument itself was a cult, even claiming that it never happened. As a result, the Phantom Thieves are still labeled as criminals, even after all that's happened. It's a storm of criticisms online, too. People are saying to catch the remnants and execute them. This is crazy. At any rate, let's wait for my sister. She should be arriving here soon. Everyone's being tricked so easily. Why the hell did we risk our lives then? If Shido isn't judged by the law, everything we've done will be treated as if it never happened. Moving the entire country however they wish by controlling people's cognition? This is no different than being inside a palace. I'm sorry. I gathered the best of the best and fought for a case. But as Makoto must have told you, it was denied. At this rate, it won't end with just Shido's innocence. This trend will continue spiraling down. There's even the possibility that crimes using the metaverse will advance onto a national scale. But that's not what I'm here to tell you. We're in danger because we know the truth. It's only a matter of time before we're apprehended. It wouldn't be odd if they were to charge in now. This makes no effing sense! Sis... There's nothing more I can do with my resources. That's why... I want to ask for your help. I wondered if there was any way you could do something one last time. 
I know that I'm in no position to ask this of you. That doesn't matter to us. So what are we gonna do? Should we change the hearts of all Shido's followers? Even if Futaba were to research all of them, it'd take time. <sighs> There's too little information. We can only target individuals. Are we no match against the national power? Mementos. If we use Mementos, we might be able to do something. There's something we can do there? Like I told you before, Mementos is the palace of the general public. It's the source of all distortions, and is maintained by the people's collective unconsciousness. Wait, do you mean that there's a treasure even in Mementos? And if we go after that... The collapse of Mementos should affect the public as a whole. The state of society would change too. If everyone's hearts grow to hold Shido responsible for his actions, things might start going our way. That's a bold plan, but an interesting one. Sounds good to me! But if we're gonna do this, there's one thing you all need to realize. To begin with, why does something like the human cognition exist as another substantial world? The reason for that is most likely sleeping within Mementos. We'll be destroying that, you know. I don't see where you're going with this. The human cognition will lose substance, so you can't sneak into people's palaces anymore. So if other criminals appear, you won't be able to steal their treasure and change their hearts. It means the Phantom Thieves will be going out of business. We'll have to discard this way of life. No. <sighs> I think we need to do this. I mean, we're the group who's reforming society, right? What do you think? As our leader, you lose your powers if Mementos is erased. Will you still do it? Yeah, that's right! You guys have all grown, huh? All right. It seems there are no objections. Did you come up with a plan? Whether it succeeds or not is another story, though. Miss Prosecutor, looks like this is gonna be our last job. Last job? Once we accomplish our duty, we entrust the world to respectful adults. That is our condition for accepting this job. This is a deal, then. That's certainly a heavy condition. But very well, I accept. I swear to make Masayo Shishido stand and be tried in the court of law. Besides, my pride won't allow me to be continually saved by you all without doing anything in return. We'll be counting on you. Looks like it's decided then. You're the leader, and this is officially our last mission. Come on, say something. He said that before, though. <laughs> That's fine. We're doing it for real this time, after all. We don't have much time, right? We should carry this out tomorrow. I'm counting on you guys. No matter what happens, you better see it through. Well, then.
Let's do it. Hey. Hey. Actually, never mind. You must be tired. Honestly, you're amazing. There's definitely something special about you. You dodge everything the enemies throw at you like it's your destiny. At first, I just thought you were going to be a useful tool for me. But now this is where I belong. Aren't you only going to be here for a year? Still, it makes me happy to hear that. It's not like me to say all that embarrassing stuff, but still, I think it's fine. For tonight, at least. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the Magician, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. We should rest in preparation for tomorrow. He 
police repelled such an ordeal, and this guy's still not being rewarded for it? If gods really do exist, they're being too hard on him. That was a fruitless delight, inmate. We gave you words of praise, but we take them all back. The source of what was hindering your rehabilitation. To think it would be the ignorant masses to which you tried to prove your integrity. Did they themselves not show elation for those who are unseen? Despite all that, they now say you do not exist. They toyed with you, yet none take responsibility. The distortion of man's world is endlessly deep. Fixing it may now be impossible, even with the appearance of a trickster. M master <gasps> It seems this is the limit of humanity. The time of ruin is nigh. One due to the distortion of man's own heart, from which none can escape. <sighs> okay. Okay, let's go. Good morning. <sighs> it's finally time. You think it'll go well? Right. It's something only we can do. See you at the usual place after school. I'll tell everyone to come. Hey, check out the nav. The door to the depths of mementos has been opened. Wait, does that mean... We're really gonna do this, right? Of course. Why are you asking now? Well, I, I just thought... What am I gonna do if you guys freak out and bail on me? We're going to erase mementos, aren't we? Come on, let's go, you guys! Mona sure seems hyped up. Say... Isn't Mona-chan behaving... a little odd? You know, you're right. Yeah. Shouldn't have brought that up. Shall we get going?
Okay, so, uh, this shit here's that door to the depths, right? I don't know, it looks just like all the other ones. I was thinking it's a little disappointing. Maybe we worked too hard to get down here or something. The lack of unforeseen circumstances is nothing to complain about. Let us continue. What the hell is this? It's some big fossil-looking thing. So this must be the treasure. Wait, look on the side. It's the train running down to Mementos. So this is where that crowd of people was trying to reach? People are walking in and out of there, so the other side of the wall must be... Wait, it's not a wall, but a giant door? Guess that means the treasure's not here. Come on, let's stay focused. I have something. Is this thing seriously a door? How are we supposed to get past? It opened straight away. I bet that means the inner depths the MetaNav was talking about before are right ahead. Hold on. The door only opens from this side. What do you mean? Well, I took a quick peek at the mechanism inside the door, and it looks like you can only open it from here. We can get in, but nothing can get out. It's as though whatever lies within has been locked away. Wait, so you're saying that the people going in there are choosing a life of imprisonment? I have never felt such eeriness before. What is this place? We'll find out once we reach the depths. Come on, let's go. I should write something. <laughs> 